Hey guys, welcome to our review of Kamen Rider Zero One, Episode One Zero, Episode Ten. As always, I'm your host of Frozen Stratos. Here with me today we have Mako Toa. Dude, welcome back. We watched this episode yesterday. Michael, you are not in frame. <clears throat> there you go. We watched this episode yesterday, and uh, we're going to be responding to your comments that you left yesterday in this review today. Uh, but as for the episode itself, I found it enjoyable. It was um, it was fun to see the characters actually enjoy each other's presence and just you know interact with each other have really good chemistry with each other and i understand that there's you know a at least part of the community or at least part of the people watching it or writer at all that you know have the opinion of oh we don't need to have all the writers like each other um in order for the show to progress i get that i understand that but at least for me it helps me enjoy the show when we don't have to deal with the manufactured drama because it usually does feel like manufactured drama that keeps them apart yeah. um even when those parts are meant to mesh together uh and that's what i'm noticing here like it feels like all these characters would work way better if we just put them all on the same team um and we did that with uh zero one and vulcan but we kind of distanced ourselves a little bit from valkyrie which is interesting even though they they've shown each other you know they did uh, ostensibly a nod to each other that they they're friendly and by they're... the end of the episode it's like yeah i would i would be sad if you died so I will, i'll try and not let you die you know Baka. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you but know? They, so... I mean, obviously, through working together, they care for each other, and we get to see that. Um, especially when push comes to shove, she will back him. You know, she doesn't want him dead, mm -hmm. but... And she cares enough the, that she the, said, hey, I'm gonna betray you. It's gonna suck. The thing that, ha the thing that convinced him that he's alright with her is that, you know, he said, is what you're doing, do you think that it's the right move? Do you think it's the right thing to do? Is that where your convictions lie? And she said it is. So he's trusting in that conviction that at the end of the day, she's going to do what's right. Mm -hmm. You know, even if she has an ulterior motive or agenda going on in the way she's going about doing it. I mean, at the same time, I still feel like it's going to end up, like, causing a, a, a bigger conflict later. But, I mean, that's what the whole thing's set up for, right? Yeah, it's, this is, sounds, I mean, yeah. as much as I dislike the manufactured drama, this is a drama. And, you know, that's just how the show's going to function and be interesting. Mm -hmm. It's just that, you know, uh, I like that better than just having to deal with these two characters butting heads just because we need to pad it out before they can be friends. You know, it's not a slow progression to camaraderie like we had with Bonjo and, and, uh, uh, Sento, you know, cause they clashed until they became friends. Yeah. Um, let's so talk yeah, about I, the, let's talk about the moments I mean, you did just briefly mention that you liked the chemistry between the characters being friendly yeah. with each other this episode. But even, uh, even like, what was it? The the co-director of the, the company BP. or whatever? Yeah, him. His moments were spot on this episode. I loved him, his, anytime he was on scene. I liked the, the actor, the old actor dude they brought in. His moments were good too. Like, mm -hmm. just the kind of hilarity of it all and... I mean, every time they were doing the scenes and then you had a fight going on in the background and our assistant robot was like, this is happening over... <laughs> like, it, the comedic timing was just on point for this episode. I really loved it. it. Yeah, it was definitely a lot of fun. And, you know, it's it's something that I appreciate out of uh, Sentai. It's, you know, getting to sit with your characters more and let them play around a little bit just so we get a sense for them. 
Uh, and on top of that, we didn't have a new form to show this episode, and it was pretty neat. Like, I mean, it was pretty bad for when I was trying to find a thumbnail, and I was like, where's the new toy that they show? <laughs> Wait, we didn't. What do I do? And then I just put a bunch of pictures of Izu doing <laughs> Do whatever it was. What, That's right. The the was. quote new form was uh that shotgun getting a boost from uh the uh the new. I mean, yeah, you technically get the prog rise key, but there you go. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know. Maybe that one was packed in with the arrow one. I don't know. I don't buy them. Um, <laughs> tell me in the comments down below if I care. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> um. But yeah, like definitely getting to sit down and let the characters actually interact and let the show breathe is really good. And we even got some stuff with Flamingo um, and giving him a little bit of. I didn't. He's, yeah, I didn't he's know more I needed of a character. Oh, sorry. I think you cut out. We must have lagged or something. But uh... he's, he's becoming more of a character. OK, yeah. Speaking of which, those moments with him where he was having that time with the with the old man actor, mm -hmm. I didn't know I needed that. And I just I ate that up. That was that was <laughs> fun. I, I like the character. I hope I hope uh, Dodo keeps coming back and does it is Dodo, not Flamingo. Oh, OK. Yeah. I mean, they're both weird looking birds. Yeah, they're pink. And like. <laughs> You know, it, or like the his form is pink. Okay, pink. yeah. Uh, and it was neat to see. I don't know. I mean, I'm sure it was an intentional parallel, but like giving the uh, the the in show assassin actor guy two swords to fight with, and Dodo actually wielding two swords. He gets yeah, to like, you, you know, I you know it it, it lends credence to like you know seeing someone like you on screen and having that be something uplifting for yourself you know uh i liked it it was it was genuine yeah yeah um outside of that we got a little bit with zaya it's all right oh yeah um we, we finally got to see his face he turns out it's actually some asian guy that they cast in the role Wow, man. I'm so surprised. Uh, they like, were hiding his face as if it was going to be someone we knew. <laughs> yeah, for but no. no reason. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just, it's one of those tropes. Yeah. He's, he's mysterious. What, we, what were we going to suspect? Oh, turns out, it's no one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean. Turns out, we don't care. <laughs> <laughs> at, at this point he's just this random ceo like guy in an empty room for some reason for some reason it's always empty not, not empty he's got one desk one desk that's, that's one all desk, you need wide space to do like pilates or yoga or whatever you want <laughs> to do whatever's happening whenever uh uh rushing cheetah is in there um that was some top-notch acting I did, lying on the floor dead. <laughs> that was just, <laughs> like we get. There were just there were just a lot of good good moments just sprinkled in, you know. So even if I I mean like the development for like a kind of side villain, which I actually quite enjoyed. It, it's all it's a win on in my book on all fronts at this point. Yeah. Like I don't really have any complaints. We didn't get a new form. Okay, you know. See, so you've got no complaints, but we do have comments. That didn't rhyme. But it started with a C and had no in it. So we're going to go to our comments, or the one comment that we got from Double the Unknown. This episode was definitely filler, but there were still some interesting moments. I'm liking Assassin Chan more and more, and was not expecting him to be the villain getting character development. The whole Fua and Yua moments were great too. The biggest thing I have to compliment the writers for is that they know how to incorporate the filler in a way that doesn't really take away from the narrative flow of the series. In this case, the movie is Hiden's way of trying to gain back support after the leaked video. It didn't really help that the dude 
just flat out said, this is going to repair every all the damage that's oh, yeah. the hospital stuff. Okay, bye. Yeah. I mean, you gotta you gotta make it obvious to the kids. The kids yeah. Watching. They they gotta they sure. gotta figure it out. Sure. So. It's, sure. It's dumb. <laughs> they need to be talked down to. Absolutely. You know, kids are just dumb. Gosh. Yeah. Of course. Yep. You heard it from Michael. That's a, definitely a Michael quote. Please, please quote yeah. me on this. Uh, out of context, context and down below. <laughs> no, no, no sarcasm whatsoever. Uh, that was completely what I think. Yes. Uh, but yeah, that's about all I care to talk about. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. Um. <laughs> Anything? No. But hey, Not this time. I've got I've got something interesting for you. Did you know that 75% of people watching this episode aren't subscribed? What? No way. Yeah, that's right. So if you've just been lurking around and you're on the fence about subscribing, definitely do that. It helps the channel out. Uh, we're trying to get to a place where we can monetize and with YouTube uh, in disarray, as it usually is. Um, it really helps if you hit the subscribe button. I don't personally use the bell function, but if that's a thing, you can do that as well. Um, but yeah, the Toku community is small. It's a subset of a subset of a community, especially in the English language. So, you know, if it'd be great if you could support the little guy. Mm. You know, just try to make it. So yeah, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Keep it juicy. See you next time. It's it's weird that you didn't end with later and there wasn't like anything between It's because there's no Alex here today. To, yeah, like I don't... do the see you part. I don't know if he legitimately forgot we were doing this. I don't know either. Yeah. Or he's just not busy. If he uh... conked out or I don't know.